My dear sisters and brothers, Yali Madat, a huge congratulations on your very well-deserved success. You know, graduating is a truly special and exciting time. It marks both an ending and a beginning. And today represents the opening of a door beyond which lies unlimited opportunity. Make the most of it. Rejoice in your successes and learn from your mistakes because both are equally important. Use your education wisely. As Molana Hazimam says, give back to your communities, ignite social change, and most of all, be a role model. Aspire to leave a positive mark on the lives of everyone that you encounter. But for now, it's time to celebrate your accomplishments. You should be extremely proud of yourselves. I know that the last 15 months has been a very tough one for all of us, but in particular for you, the students. So let us recognize not only your hard work, but also your resilience, your adaptability, and your dedication. I wish you all the very, very best in this next chapter of your lives. Yali Madat. Yali Madat, everybody. Congratulations, Mumbaraki, and well done in your graduation. You have graduated at a time when there's been a lot of uncertainty and turbulence. So your achievement actually is much more than many have achieved in the past. And this shows you have good capabilities, resilience and determination to succeed. So you should be proud of yourself. Your family should be proud of yourselves. And we certainly are very proud. Well done. So the question in your head is what next? On the short term, you might be thinking of, well, I'll have some rest. Fine. Have a lion. Why not? Um, and you might be thinking, let me travel. So where shall I go? To a red zone, amber zone, green zone, or have a staycation in the UK? Well, on the short term, do as you wish, but certainly hope you have time to celebrate and enjoy with your family. But very soon, in the next few months, you may come across a situation where, where you might be thinking, where am I going? Where will I be in three or five years time? And I would urge you to think of that. Don't think too short term, because in this current age, people are looking at options of career paths and further education all the time. And in fact, Molina Hazimam always tells us about lifelong learning, as you all well know. Um, I want to quote just one speech or one excerpt that Hazimam made um, and this was actually in a banquet in Dar es Salaam in Tanzania on August the 18th, 2007. And I'll just quote, No honor is like knowledge. No belief is like modesty and patience. No attainment is like humility. No power is like forbearance. And no support is more reliable than consultation. The passage beginning with the word knowledge and ending with the word consultation sums up my message to you tonight. It is in my prayer that all of us, with a common commitment to knowledge and in a continuing spirit of consultation, can go for forward further to meet our great challenges." Unquote. So what Hazimam tells us here is that consult each other. We have a great network of Ismailis. Uh, and others, that friends that you know, there is no harm in consultation. President and myself still consult now. We're always consulting. We always learn from others. And I would urge you to share and learn best practices and from experience that others have, have gained. And the institutions also can help you. So please do come to the institutions. But what is it that you can do as well? Well, you are now educated and in Islam, we are taught by Molana Hazimam that one of the purposes of education is obviously to achieve your own goals. But once you achieve that, you have to be reminded to help others. There are many others who need your help. You are educated. You can mentor people. You can help institutions and communities. 
you can do lots and lots of voluntary service when the time is right for you. So please remember that. And also a reminder that re really you should be coming back to our prayers and our Jamaat Khanas, always be that, always, that will always be there with you. You should always try and be friendly to everybody else that's around you. You should definitely be the mentors that you, you have now achieved. And finally, I just want to say to you, enjoy the rest of your summer with your family and your friends because you deserve it. So well done again and Mumbarak. Mumbarak to all the students and wishing you all the best for the future. This is such an exciting time. All of your hard work has paid off. So enjoy your holidays and we wish you great success in all of your endeavours in the future. Congratulations from all of us. Congratulations ISN family. You've made it through three, four, five, maybe six years of studying, maybe even more, but now you've achieved this milestone of getting your degree. So well done, congratulations, fighting through everything that the pandemic had to throw your way. You did it. Remember that the ISN family is not just for those who are students, but actually we are there for students, for graduates, for young professionals like yourself as you enter the next chapter of your lives. And also remember that the Jamaat needs you. Now that you're a graduate, you have even more to offer than you might already have had before. There are young people who might be aspiring to go to the university you've just graduated from, maybe to even do the degree that you've been pursuing. So remember, there will be people who will look up to you now, who will want to learn from you. So stay connected, you can be a mentor to them and you can help to give back to the community that is here for you. We look forward to welcoming you with open arms as you are now enter the next chapter of the ISN network. Congratulations. Yali Madat and congratulations to all of you on your achievements so far. You will now all be embarking on another journey. Remember along the way, there will be many challenges and hurdles. Come across banana skins that will trip you up. But with determination, perseverance, hard work, inshallah, you will all reach your goals. Yali Madad, and um, congratulations on um, achieving and um, graduating. So well done, and I'm sure your families will be very proud of you. So we're going to just share a bit of uh, Mulana Hazri Imam's um, speeches. Uh, it is uh, His Highness the Aga Khan speaking to a Western academic audience at Brown University, 1996. One of the things most often said to university students on their graduation day is that they must now prepare to face the real world. You should be glad to hear that I am not going to tell you that. But as someone who has been living and working in the real world for a very long time, I can tell you this, the world now is a different place. It is different from what it was 40 years ago, five years ago, different even from last month's world. It is different because we are witnessing a massive acceleration in the rate of global change. Today's world is a living environment in which you have to adapt much faster than your parents did in order to have a positive and constructive impact on the future. Having said that, the means at your disposal to achieve such an impact have multiplied exponentially during the last decade. Never before has there been so much knowledge available about so many different people. Never before have we known more about the physical world in which we live. Never before have the opportunities been greater to make a better life for more people around the globe. Once again, congratulations to all of you. One of the, you know, for a few achievements where you start. World is your oyster. And you are the change. You can bring the change. Good luck and good wishes. Yali Madar. Yali Madar. After a long journey, your hard work paid off. You all have become graduated today. Congratulations 
on this momentous day. You have all worked hard to achieve your goals and now you are all on your way to seek new wisdoms. Dream new dreams. Embrace life with patience and keep reaching for your goals. Go for it. Keep working hard and make your parents proud. Happy graduation on behalf of Kamriya Saeed and Mukhyani Ma of Bad Sals of Lane. To all the students who have graduated in 2021 through the various schools and institutions, Kamri Saeed, Mukhi Saeed of Southeast London Jamaat Khana wish you sincerely and with great, great happiness, we wish you Mubarak. Congratulations on your success and we pray that you, your quest for knowledge does not end and it continues. Many, many congratulations and we wish you lots of luck with that quest and whatever you hope for in the future. Yali Mother, everyone, on behalf of the Manchester Jamaat, I would like to congratulate all the students graduating this year. We wish you all lots of success and we wish you all lots of happiness in all your future endeavors. Many congratulations on your wonderful achievement. We are all very proud of you. Good luck in your future endeavors. Well done. Congratulations, class of 2021. Congratulations on your graduation. It's not only a proud moment for you, but also for us. The need for optimism is important. Mulana Hazramam has talked about the power of hope. So hope and dream, this will motivate you. All the best, and we pray for your success in both your material and spiritual lives. Congratulations, class, class of, of 2021. 2021. Kanigani Mumbaraki to all the graduates. Uh, we hope uh, this knowledge that you've gained will uh, help you towards your career in the future. And also, if you contribute and build on your success by sharing your knowledge with the Jamaat and with the, uh, with the wider community, you will build even more success uh, coming out of this. And we wish you many congratulations and Kanigani uh, Mumbaraki again. Kani Gani Mumbaraki to you. Congratulations and well done. Ya Ali Madad. First of all, I would like to congratulate you all on your graduation. Our religion, Islam, begins with the word Ikra. That means to read. That was the first message from Allah to our beloved Prophet. So one can understand the importance of education and knowledge. Malana Hazimam tells us always, about lifelong learning. Hopefully we'll keep this always in our mind. I wish you once again the best for the future. Take care and stay blessed. Ya Ali Madad and Khuda Hafiz. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim and Ya Ali Madad in the name of Muki Kamrias from Berlin, headquarter Jumat Khana for German in Austria we want to wish you most, most of Mubaraki for your gratification. Education is the most important for building peace in the world. Please don't let us forget what Maulana Hazimam told us, that every leader in this world need to work for peace, that every parent in this world can have space to give their children education. Thank you very much and Mubaraki to you and to your families. Yalling with that to everyone. My name is Ali. I'm the Muki side for the Munich Jamaat Khana in Germany. I would like to especially congratulate all the graduates this year. It has been a difficult year, but remember all your hard work has not been in vain. Your perseverance will get you through. And inshallah, we pray that all of you will succeed in all your endeavors and that all your good wishes will come true. Amin and thank you.